Hey, look at people. Welcome. Oh, I have to turn the fan off. It's hot in these streets. I don't want to turn any fans off. Oh, my retainer's still in. Okay, excuse the list. All right, so we're going to tackle this space starting today. That mirror I put in my entryway was there. So now it looks very bare. There's just some plants down there. This thing here with all my beauty products in it, I moved it from right here because I have an idea. But now this is just full of crap and there's just a lot of space here and here. So first things first, I need a vanity chair and I was supposed to go get one last time but I didn't. So even though it's gonna rain, I'm gonna drive out to RH Outlet, pick up sis on the way, let's go. All right, so I got several options. This one I could go with the classic and it looks like the rest of my chairs, you know? I like this one. That one's unique. I always go for the clearance chairs here. They're still expensive. Some are cheaper than others though. All right, it's gonna be Queen Anne or Parsons. I sat in both and they're both comfortable, but I sink into this one. I mean, that was cheaper. I don't know. So that was a very successful shopping trip. I got a vanity chair. They're wrapped in plastic. I'm just gonna leave it for the moment. I also got a new plant. <laughs> I went to the plant store because I was out and I, I love the plant store. Plants make me happy. Look at this beauty. Isn't it beautiful? I love the yellow flower. Yellow is my favorite color for anyone who's new. Um, this is a Aphalandra Dania Zebra. Never heard of it, I'm gonna look it up. Um, it's a high, highlight plant though, so it'll do fine right here. Now I have a trio of plants here. We've got that Aphalandra. We've got a, a Hindu rope, it, which is a Hoya. And we have a Alocasia, a variety of Alocasia. And it's just really pretty right here with the white pot, the yellow pot, and then the nursery pot. I'm not going to take it out of there. So, yeah, that's really cute. So, you may notice that there's a big space here. I did have the mirror, right, that I put in my entryway here. And when I did that, I had already decided that I was going to move one of my bookshelves in here. and move all my fiction in here. And my books um, are not organized. I never organize them. They're just here. So I've got to take, I'm going to take them off of the nonfiction shelf here and move that bookshelf and then move all these books and the fiction shelf onto the bookshelf in my room. And since I never organized them, I'm going to organize them. This is going to take me hours, but why not? I want this to be a one-time thing. Let's do it. Y'all, I love having this here so much. This plant is, um, like, that's how I get humidity on my plant, like, deep humidity on my Hoya. Um, but I'm loving this bookshelf being here. Like, I'm loving this whole vibe right here. And it made me change my plans. <laughs> so, I'm about to move my other bookshelf, my other tall one, right here. And three, two, one, and voila, it is here. I, so you'll see a little of what I have in mind here. So let me back up. So you can now see both bookshelves are here with my vanity. There's some stuff there because I use my vanity, right? I'm going to move another one of my pothos and put it up there. I need to get a like little base thingy, like the cork one right there. So it doesn't damage the top of the um, bookcase. So I'm going to do that. But I'm getting a jewelry case, right? So that's happening. And I think think I'm going to put that here. We'll see um, whether this stays or not. I'm, I'm thinking there's space down there. I think I'm going to put it down there um, and then just take out a few polishes. But we'll see. As you can see, I have perfumes and my lipsticks right here now. So we'll see how this ends up um, as I go buy things. Um, also that I think I'm going to put on top um, because I rarely, like I just, it's a drawer that is functional. So like I can open it and get out what I need. It's all my rollers. Um, and then my Comcast box, I need to move it. But um, yeah, I'm really happy with this. 
and this is a step in the right direction. I hem and hawed over this so much, but I think this is a step in the right direction, and this will be my filming background too, by the way, because this is where I film. So for anyone who's been here a while, you knew that I had this as my reading nook in my office, and I actually moved it out here, so now it's like right with the rest of my entertainment stuff, and then I moved my third bookshelf right here. I need to pick that up. It's from laundry. But um, it's actually perfect in this little like nook here. And I had this print since I moved here. Like I bought it when I was still at my sister's house. And I just hadn't put it up because I had no idea where to put it. And so I put it there with painter's tape to make sure I want it there. And I really, I really actually love this. I'm gonna turn it vertical so you guys could see. But this is just like a perfect little thing right here. It bridges the gap between this area, this, and going into my room with all the bookshelves. So I love, love, love it. Okay, so after I get my hair together, we're gonna head to the container store, one of my favorite places, to look for a jewelry case. I wanna stack some, I'll show you, um, and make a jewelry case. I measured this um, drawer situation, or this, I measured from here, like the length, or the width, sorry, and the height. So I knew how much space I have here. Um, I move my perfumes around, but I'll show you guys when we're like doing the full tour. But we're gonna go to the container store, and the goal is to not spend hundred more than $150. I'm gonna look at some beauty organizations just because, you know, I might be inspired, but yeah. Looking specifically for a jewelry case stack. I'll show you what I mean. I like this color. I need to find one that's open. I like the clear lid though. Hmm. So many choices. Ooh, a mini deep tray. This could be good for some um, uh, perfumes. For sunglasses. I love this store. <laughs> $129. Thing is, I really would prefer the clear open top. So I could stack it myself if I did that. Kind of leans towards the shorter one. So you can get them separately. This one has this longer section here, and these, and these will be for necklaces. This is like for um, bracelets and things. So that's an option. I just like being able to see. I don't need this. This is like too big. I do like the earring option. Choices. A lid that's clear. So I can switch out the lid and put this on instead. I wonder if they have that for the shorter one. Is this the same? No, this is like a blue tone. There's so many options. You guys can't see the color. Hmm. I should focus. <laughs> color choice ended up being easy because I chose based on what was on sale. And now I know I needed to get something from the grocery store on the way home and I can't remember what it was. Either way, I'll show you guys organizing and everything. And Yo, I just experienced a bit of serendipity. You ready for this? I went to Crate and Barrel to look at something that I had an idea to use for my vanity here for further organization and just beautification, right? I really like the brighter marble, but they don't have it on a tier tray. But I wish they did. I like it better. It was on sale, and I could use my 50, 15 percent off coupon. 
So I was meant to get it this weekend. <laughs> I was just meant to. And so now I'm gonna put this together and <laughs> clean my beauty blenders um, because this is going to be gorgeous. I wasn't sure I was gonna get this. I didn't wanna pay like $100 for it and I didn't. I paid 50 and your girl is happy. Very happy. I do wish this was brass, but I also don't want to like spray paint it or anything. Um, it's a good quality product. So let's put this together. Ha, so happy. It's got feet, so that's cool. I mean, this is really good quality. Look at that marble. Oh, such good quality. All right, it goes this way. Okay, so also from the container store, because I'm going to switch this up. Brushes. Clean beauty blenders. Gotta take that tag off. More brushes, right? So the big brushes, small brushes, clean beauty blender, and then this is going to go behind it. Um, but I'm going to put other things in here instead of what's in here right now. Is that not perfect? Yes. Okay. So I'm going to clean this stuff and then we'll go from, I'll show you like, again, I'll show you everything in the end <laughs> once it's all nice and organized. But I got to clean my beauty blenders, take some of these tags off, so forth and so on. Clean my brushes, really. I don't know if I'm going to right now, but I need to do that. <laughs> But I'm so happy with this. Isn't this beautiful? And this will just sit here instead. And I'll put my mirror over there. And it's just a great way to organize everything. I'm going to put some perfumes down here. And it not be like so obtrusive. And I can put this in the bathroom because I do need one of these in the bathroom. And I'll still, I measured it. So I'll still be able to open this right here. Boom. Always take a little tape measure with you <laughs> wherever you go so you can be sure. But isn't this beautiful? Mm, yes! Alright guys, do you see that? Doesn't that look wonderful? I know I'm off to the side, but look! All I need right there is some art, like right here, which I haven't picked out but it's not available. I'll explain it in the next video. Just know that like my sister has this eye, whether the artist knows that they should print something or not. And then she like messages them and gets them, but it's a process. So um, I'll explain more about it. Something's up with my voice, so I apologize, but I freaking love it. The chair, the chair is perfect. I've been living with it. I put that little uh, foot thing that I had in my um, office, I put that there for like doing my pedicures and stuff and it's just it's a1 a plus the bookshelves are great that's my new jewelry case love it that little marble tray thing i got absolutely perfect absolutely perfect really there's only one more thing i need here that's art and i need to get a longer plug for my box for my internet box but that's it i love this space when we come back i gotta do the rest of the room i need art in the rest of the room I need um, lamps for the nightstands. I need to change the organization on my dresser. There's so much to do still in this room. I want a whole other like duvet. My duvet is, um, um, I'll show y'all. But if you missed the intro I make over, then check out this video here, right here. And if you want to see more vlogs from me, then check out this playlist right here, which is my Ritonti Diaries. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure you like and subscribe before you go so we can see each other in the next one. Bye.